Welcome back. Yes, you are back with your boy Scarcious. We are in the Open Great League. And we have our midi champ on the lead face up against Anna Zumero. Sticking around for now. We're going to short up their player off. Build up some more energy and then we're gonna offload our first psychic here. Yeah? See how they feel like that. Most likely we'll let it go. They do, of course. Building up to the next one, offloading. And then we should look to dip out of it. Swap, catch the charge move clean on our Reggie still. Do they wanna stick around or do they wanna swap out right now? They wanna swap out. So they've swapped out into their Marowak. That's absolutely fine. We can take a charge move, which they'll be throwing here. It's the Shadow Bone. That's absolutely fine. Now we're going to go for our Zap. Potentially get a drop. Yep, drop their attack. Nice. They will farm us down here. No problem. We can just come with a zoom roll and bubble this down. They will throw a charge move before they do go down here, but it's absolutely fine. Shadow Bone doesn't do much at all, as you can see. You already know Azumarill is built nice and thick. They come back in with their Azumarill. That gets bubbled down too, and in the back, they're going to have to hold on to the Ice Beam. But they showed up. And then they decide to top left. All right, and Glasgow didn't want any smoke with a zoom roll, of course. So we move swiftly into the next one, faced up against the Steelix, and we love to see it. But they don't, so they swap out into their dragon there. And our zoom roll doesn't mind this at all, so we're gonna offload that ice beam. I don't think they'll like this. So they shield it up. And we're just gonna build up, resisting the dragon breath, of course. What do they wanna throw? Is it body slam? Yeah, it is. Absolutely fine. They're gonna throw another one. Also absolutely fine, we can let that go. All right, build up a bit more. And they're gonna throw another one. We're gonna shield this one. Let's see if we can build up a bit more energy here and then offload but they decide to swap out into their steelix that's absolutely fine we're gonna offload hydro pump big damage and then swap to a medicham to farm it down they're most likely gonna go for a breaking swipe here we don't mind it at all you can just farm down that steelix bye bye steelix and dragonair comes back they're gonna have to hold on to this debuffed ice punch Still does big damage and we counter it down, so bye bye Dragon there also. And in the back, they have Lantern. It's absolutely fine. The clock's not gonna be ready for now, so we're just gonna throw the debuffed Psychic. Still does a respectable amount of damage because this Lantern is going low on health, hence why they wanna throw their energy and get rid of my Medicham. So they throw that surface, absolutely fine. We've got Reggie still for them. And yeah, it's not looking too great for them. You can already see where this one is heading, but they're gonna try and fight the good fight. Throwing the Thunderbolt, we just let that go. And then we can just ramp up and see if we can get a debuff on them here. What's the vibe? Of course they're shielding that, and we do get a debuff on them. Attack falls. And we're not expecting them to go for a Thunderbolt, we're expecting them to go for two Surfs here. So let's see if that's what they decide to do. It is what they decide to do. We no shielded it. And now we could just go for the focus blast and wrap this one up. GG's. Nicely done. All right, moving swiftly into the next one. All right, faced up against a Wobbuffet here. And Wobbuffet is tanky. We swapped straight out into our Reggie still. They're sticking around at the moment. And we're gonna go for that zap, seeing if we can get a debuff on them. 
Yeah, the debuffs are coming in clutch. So let's see what they want to do. They're sticking around to throw their charge move. Okay, they offload the return. That barely does anything, of course. Gonna offload the zap. Once again, let's see what they're feeling like. This Wobbuffet is built crazy thick. They dip out into their own Reggie Steel. And now we're offloading Focus Blast on it. Big damage. All right, so they're gonna go for a Focus Blast of their own, I suspect. Yes, let that go. Cause we can just come in with many and just farm this all the way down. They won't get to a charge move. Bye bye Reggie Steel. And now they're coming with their third, which is Pelipper. We're stacked on energy. So let's offload. Go for that psychic. They respect it with a shield. And then we swap out into our Zoomeral. Did we catch a weather ball? We definitely did. That is not very effective. Alright. Now they will most likely go for the hurricane. We can shield that up. And we do not because a zoom roll is built too thick. And now they're going to come in with their Wobbuffet. And they go for Miracle. So they're probably going to go for the return next. Absolutely fine. We're going to offload. Offload. Ice Beam. Can we get to another one before they get to a charge move? We could have, but we tried to overload on energy. Are we looking to shield and farm down here? No, we just let that go and then swap out. Countering down the Wobbuffet. Nice. Bring back that Pelipper. Hold on to this Psychic. They might want to give up their last shield here, though. And we do. So what do we want to do? This is where we got to make our decisions. They should be going for Weather Ball from here. They do, and we survived that, of course. We're not going to get to the Psychic, so we offload the Ice Punch. Any chip is better than none, because we can set up the Zoom Roll to finish this one off. And that's exactly what we do. Throwing the Ice Beam to wrap this one up like a Christmas present, and that is GG's. All right, taking that W, let's move swiftly on into the next one. Let's get them. Okay, who we got here? We got Charizard. Okay, we don't fancy this matchup, but we're sticking around for now. All right, we're gonna shield up. Let's see if we can grab a shield too. I mean, they decide to dip out instead, which is fine by me because they swapped into Steelix. So we're in with our Reggie Steel. And this Steelix isn't going to be able to do much against our Reggie still unless it's running Earthquake. But they throw a break and swipe. And we are throwing a Focus Blast, which will definitely do some big damage. And they're throwing very early once again. So we already know this is not Earthquake. We can just lock on down. Lock on all the way down. Come out of energy ready for whatever wants to come in. And they bring back the Charizard. I'm expecting them to shield this. Because you already know this will do big damage. Their attack falls here. Registro's job is done. We don't need to shield up of course. Letting the blast burn go. And bringing in a zoom roll. They swap out into Swampert, so we swap into our Medicham, who is stacked with energy. Offload the Psychic, big damage. Yeah. What's the vibes? We're gonna go for Hydro Cannon here, we're gonna let that go, we survive. And we can get to another charge move. It's gonna be the Ice Punch this time. What do they want to do? They decide to shield, that's absolutely fine with me. Because the zoom roll can bubble down and we don't even have to shield either. The zoom roll is nice and healthy and also very thick. They go for the earthquake. Oh my days, it doesn't even do half. They realize the vibe, so they top left. And that is G to the G. As much as we would have loved to hydro pump that Charizard in his face, it's all good.
on to the last one though. Let's get it. All right, faced up against the Zoom rules. The Zoom rules are back, trust me. We know. All right, the shiny flexing. All right, so offloading our psychic here. What's the vibe? Can we get a defense drop? No, we can't. Get a shield up there, charge move. Expecting play rough. It is the play rough. All right, we're gonna have to make a play here. Do we want to try a catch attempt? We're gonna offload our energy first and see what the vibe is. All right, as we was very low, we swap instantly and catch the charge move. Yes, resisted on the Reggie Steel, and then they come in with Charizard Shadow. Absolutely fine with us. We're gonna offload that Zap Cannon. I mean, they have this shield, right? Yep, shield that, get their attack dropped. Reggie Steel, your job is done, my friend. Let that blast burn go and come with a zoom roll. Put in some work. We don't even have to shield, of course. That blast burn tickles. We're just gonna put in work with them bubbles, man. Offloading the ice beam. This will get rid of their Charizard. Bye bye. And in the back, they have Ferrophone. Okay. Stacked up on energy. <laughs> we swap out into our mini champ and then they decide to swap out with 3 HP. Just get farmed down. So they're just giving us free energy. We don't mind that. Alright, now we just offload in the ice punch. And the counters will be putting in work. They have no shields left. Counters are putting in work here. They throw their charge move because the counters are just putting in too much work. That's absolutely fine. Azumaro likes the sounds of that. Now, we can offload the ice beam here and we should get to another ice beam. But that one wraps it up. And that was the last battle. So thank you guys for coming by once again. You all take care now. Peace.